Hello and welcome to a special uh, version of uh, Minecraft. Uh, I'm, every Sunday I'm going to uh, uh, show off uh, a, a, a world that's been created uh, in Minecraft and uh, we're starting off uh, this Sunday's uh, world as my own and and as you can see this is this is this one so, uh, one portion of my world uh, my uh, city I started city back in 2009 when Minecraft was just an alpha stage um, and at that time uh, there was only really one I think a couple of biomes like the uh, the grass uh, like a normal uh, like biome like you get here and um, we're well not with the yeah we're probably with a bit of snow I can't remember back then if there was snow or not but you had these sort of trees you can see the 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 color this is actually uh, 1.9 generation so you, see, you talk about a while back there was uh, there was a sand biome but that was about it on that um, so as I said this this is my creative world and I'm going to give you a a, a little um, demo and show you around. So we'll might well start off here. This is my highway. This is a, a motorway that actually does a ring. Um, it loops right, almost right around my entire city. Um, and currently here, I'm, I'm building uh, uh, an extension to to my airport. So if we just wander over here, we'll see it's uh, it's a big big area, and it's going to take me some time um, to 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 complete this. This is a project. It's probably going to take me about a, a six to eight months to build. Um, as you can see, this is this is now the new generation. So what I did was this is you can see the old generation block here. This um, what I did is I took the old worlds into MC Editor. And then I deleted all the chunks around my uh, city, so it could generate the new new biomes. So we're going to take going to take this um, this fancy uh, looks like a futuristic little train uh, with a little rowing boat uh, to the main uh, to the main part of the airport. So we hop in the boat, and this runs extremely fast. It's packed high, so we run along here extremely fast. I'll get here well, it's a little bit fiddly this part here but we'll make it and this is even this is a lot quicker than flying in creative world so we take this along let's get going look at the speed of this it is I'm losing a bit of packet I was doing it because it's such there we go we'll run along it should it will take us right into the main airport the the train hangar there we go <laughs> it's going so fast it actually knocks me into the into the wall so this is the the main uh terminal let's just fly out here it's a lot easier because i'm going to be here all day um this is the main um uh, almost like a train terminal of the airport that i've created here and i said i haven't done much to it i've literally just built uh, a massive uh almost like a hangar sort of thing so if we go here, this should be filled in with shops and so forth. But again, I, I just don't have the time. Um, and then we go into the actual airport itself. So we've got the check-in desk that I've created along here. And if we come out of here, we've got we've got this nice fancy feature here. We've got a multi-story car park over there. And we've got a hotel over in that corner there. So if we come in here, we can actually go through the terminal itself. Um, and have a look. So we've got these are check-in desks. I haven't labelled them at all. But if we come along here, this is the security area. So it's already laid out, all nice and uh, so forth. We come here. This is supposed to be a security where you get yourself checked out. Um, and then this takes you up to the lounge. Now there is no private lounge. It's just, just an open lounge. So this is a bit like how you walk through, it, say Gatwick Airport. You go through the shops here. Uh, these are the tills if you want to buy stuff. This is the waiting area which overlooks the uh, the rail terminal. And if we come along here, we've got more um, more seating areas and so forth. I think I actually built a shop somewhere around here. Uh, so yeah, we've got this is what I call the premium lounge access here. There's some shops, and we've got some more premium access up here. 
um, which overlooks onto the uh, the airport itself. So if we come back and go through as if we're going to go onto a plane, so we'll come along here, and I believe I hear this is where we go to the the actual gates. So we come here and we can go along here. So we'll go along this way. I haven't actually built any planes into this um, this um, airport as of yet, um, but I will do in time. So this would board and go straight onto a plane. And you can see this is the runway here, and that's a that's that's that ring road as I mentioned up in the corner, rings right around. So if, say if we came off the plane, we would have to then go to uh, arrivals, um, and arrivals is where's is that? I haven't been on this in such a long time. It's along here, I think. Along here, I think it is. So you come along here, along yep, yeah, and you go down here, and this will take you into into the um, where you collect your luggage. A lovely purple from the the end. Um, yeah, so you go down these gates. Um, you come to security here or customs. Customs would be here. That's if you get checked out and so forth in that. And then these are scans like, have you got anything to declare? So there we go. And then we got where the luggage comes up. And these are supposed to be the belts. And, and then once you come out here, you can come out and exit out here. You're know, back into the main, uh, the main terminal building. As I said, I'm extending it into into um a, a big a bigger terminal so we'll have this will be domestic and there'll be an international with twice the size of the it's going to look a bit like um uh probably los angeles or something like that and as you come out you go welcome to my world so we'll start here as i said we'll come along here and this is a residential block here that i built this is one of my one of my first skyscrapers so long before we had concrete so it looked all built in in wool and if we come right up to the top i think none of these none of these rooms are um you know just standard rooms i built here none of them are um been filled in properly they're not uh, they haven't got any furniture or anything in it um but that one's empty um but we've got one here that's this is a penthouse suite it's on two floors at the top um, and we can we can go to this penthouse suite by just going along here come in here and this is our lovely penthouse suite overlooking the airport when this built the airport wasn't here it was just an empty um, area but it's a, it's a lovely view um, if I had my VR headset I think this would look amazing really do um, so that's looking over onto the city that I've built so we'll go back up here and we'll fly out and have a look around the other parts of the city so we've got this is like a beach area down here and we'll come down swooping down this is a nice beach here um, so we've got the beach um, and this is a nice area to this is this is I built this quite a while ago. I think it's one of the first beaches I built. Um, and we've got a sewage outlet there. Um, I don't know where that goes actually. Uh, this is a business uh, block. Um, and then we got try not to copyright because there is a, a supermarket. There is a supermarket here. I'm not showing it all because it's um, I'll get copyright problems but that is the supermarket and then we've got we've got an underground car park here trying to be a little bit art deco not art deco modern modern I should we say that's a modern car park there and then up here we've got another office block oh I'll be froze yes we have um, what I've done is the freezing is actually these lights coming on so they come on during the night time this is a little sh shopping center i built um it's like i've built it into little cubes with a with a multi-story car park these on to the back of it these are more uh, business apartments here 
we've got nice business partners. You can see I've gone for the theme, a white theme. Now down here is a metro system. And I don't know where these take, oh, it's been such a long time. So we'll ride one and see where it goes. I think this could take us to a train station. So we'll just give it a, a whirl and see where we go. I didn't plan this out. I think it's this one here. We need to ride. So let's push it a bit. Let's get into And um, we'll push it a bit. I think this takes us to the main train station, but I may have blocked it off. We'll have a, we'll have a gander. But this actually takes us near to um, when I, I had this in survival for a brief time. Oh, it's very loud. Right. If you can't hear me, I'll, um, I'll exit it over. Goes on for a bit, I think. Yeah, up into the distance. And this is the old part where you put the mine. A bit more there. Not more bits of my mining. Oh, got bats here. Hello. Yeah, and this is the train terminal. And here we are at the train terminal on the other side of the city. Um, this is one of the main train terminals I built uh, quite a while ago. Um, so we come out here, uh, and so it's just a train terminal. Let me just set uh, time today. There we go. Get my stick. Oh, what's happened to that light there? That's a bit missing. Look what happened there. As you can see, the block, the end of the block ends there. We'll go over there in a moment. But this is here. This is the back of a. Um, can you guess it? it? Probably just looks like a building. But we come inside here. It's actually quite a special building. Um, it took me a while to build. It's a. It's a um, some of my past. What I used to do. Uh, or study. Can you guess it? It's a TV studio. Look at this, we've got an actual studio here. Uh, we've got where guests would talk. This is the main platform. We run along here. I think this takes you to another TV studio. Yes, a game show. So I thought this is a game show. So we've got, say, contestants. We've got seating area here, the gallery up there. Um, we'd have a VIP area around there. This is just empty here. Uh, and then we come along here and this should take us to actually the first uh, area I actually built. But this was before I built the TV studio. This was um, here was just my first underground, oh well, this base here. And this is the uh, remnants of it, uh, of my base here. Um, it used to be, there used to be a castle, well, a, a lookout tower when mobs didn't get me. Um, so now I've, 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 I've broken it down a lot. Um, also here, there's a church I built, and I built this before this before Creative came along. I, think, I can't remember if a Creative was in 1.9, but especially in the early days, it was just survival. I built this all by hand. This is a church. This took me forever to build. Um, I think it was one of my main big builds. It took me absolutely forever to build. It's amazing. These are uh, basically three three blocks uh, thick. And you see, I've still got the beds. I've left the beds here. Is there anything in the chest? Can't open the chest. It's a little bit worrying. Oh, there we go. I think the chest. And this would take me down to my mining area. But I think now I've left it as a, uh, I think there's a sewage works, yeah. So this is all mined out for that church above. But now this takes down to, yeah, this is that, that sewage. This is a, a sewage area. And that goes out to sea. And that goes all the way to the other area where I pointed out. Um, that thing, I think you turn the lights on. Or oh, have I broken them? 
Yeah, the lights, some of the lights go on. I've, <laughs> I've probably broken the circuits. That one didn't work at all. Um, there's another one down here. But yeah, the circuits, these lights used to turn on and off um, a while ago. Alright, so let's go back to the surface. And we'll have to take a tour of the other end. I built a holiday resort. So this is my, this was my f very first train station here, and I've decided to leave as memory the um, the end part of that uh, station. As you can see, there's the arches that came in, and it used to go all the way to the end here. Um, but as I said, I've left it as a, uh, a rem to remember. That's where the station, the train station used to be. So we'll go along down here, uh, and I've got another big skyscraper here. Um, come along. This is my um, like a, um, a tram line, and it runs uh, as loop right around the inner city. At the time of my building this, it used to be just a stone structure, and I've upgraded it quite a few times now to look like this uh, this futuristic tram. And this used to be the actual size of my city, so that this was all fields and grassland and so forth. But as I say, you can see I've built up. This is one of the first bridges I've built in, in, in my city. And this, these, these, where this skyscraper here, there was a big, big mountain went up like that and around, and I've, I've mined it all out. So this is like a little a swanky area. I've got a few little shops here. Um, little shops here there used to be a few more but I've, I've bulldozed them down for this little road here and this road actually used to go along here there used to be a bridge here it goes right across but i, I felt it would be better as a, a underground um tunnel sort of thing that's a um like an office block there um as we come along you can probably see a little bit remnants of my uh, my bridge i used to have along here and then we're coming to the end of the uh, the old the old chunk of 1.9, and this is the new boundary of the new part. And I see. I haven't built it at all. Built it up at all at the moment. I plan to get rid of this. Um, this is a, a modern house I'm trying to build. I haven't really touched it. So work in progress. This is one of the a tutorial house I've got off another YouTuber. This is this is my main house I built uh, here. We'll go inside. We'll have a look inside. Um, I haven't really done much to it, but we can see in here. Nice got uh, curtains. Got uh, got nice. Uh, I think this is this is another little room. This is the garage. This is the kitchen. It's actually lit up by uh, lights underneath there, um, and that's the garden out there. We'll have a quick brief upstairs. Now they, you can get campfires now, so I plan to probably put the the fireplace that's up here at the moment. I plan to put um, there's a fire that takes up to the attic and something up in the attic. The fireplace here. I plan to put some uh, camper uh, fires down here. Uh, which will look good, and we'll go up into the uh, we'll smoke up wood, which will uh, be a nice added theme. So let's uh, let's go back downstairs. I need to light this up a bit more, but luckily we're in creative mode, so nothing will spawn here. We'll come out here, and then this is the garden. We've got a pool, some sound lounges, and we've got some fish swimming in the pool. Uh, that's probably uh, uh, due to the 1.14 upgrade. Well, what's happened there? It looks like coarse dirt. I don't know. I'll pop that light there for now. Got a little football pitch. And this is a hotel here. Uh, this is one of the first hotels I've built. Um, I probably will um, make it a little bit modern. We've got a little swimming pool area here. We've got a private little beach area. And then we've got over here. We've got um, we've got sun lounges for the for the beach itself. So I've come over here. Oh, just bear me one moment. Uh, 
Um, and so we come over here. And this is what I built because I love this festival. Can you guess what it is from a distance? This is Glastonbury, or a Glastonbury is, I keep calling it Glastonbury, it's a Glastonbury. So I've built uh, a homage to, to, the, to the festival, and this is a quite, this is a very small version. I plan to redo this and do it as a massive, tall uh, pyramid. I've even got lights that are flashing, got a little flash, lights that are flashing on and off. Um, and this is the main stage. And look at that, that'd be amazing if that was the real stage. You would come out here and you'd come out to the main area. Um, and now, if we come into the back of this area, there's a, a lovely, um, this is like the VIP area of the, of the place. Um, there's so much to show. I might have to break this up into two episodes, to be honest, because um, there's so much to show. This is the hospital, and and here is um, this is a this is another work in progress. I'm rebuilding this. This is actually an Olympic running ground. As you see, this before I got the hang of doing circles, and I was just doing this this a little. Um, Looks pretty good, a little running track, but I, I, as you can see, I'm rebuilding it. It's going to look fantastic when that's that's completed. Um, what I've also done, this took me absolutely months in creative world. This this is one of the Twin Towers um, uh, back in the day before the ter terrorism. This is, I, I just, even in creative, you can see each, this took absolutely painstaking. I didn't do it, use any mods, this is just pure me doing this creative world, one floor off the now we can see it's going on. Take me ages to scroll in up. And as we get to the top, look at this. It's a massive skyscraper. Now I built the the new modern one here, but as I, I literally got a bit fed up <laughs> with it and I didn't build any floors, so it's quite empty inside apart from the, the couple of floors. I was, as you can see point down here, I was going to build a replica of this, but because it took so long to build this, I just couldn't be bothered to build a second one. Uh, so it, just, it would take months. So I actually built the uh, the second one as the new the new uh, World Trade Center. This is a, a swimming pool, and uh, we've got over here. I think I think that's that's the majority of it. We've got we've covered. Uh, probably what I'll do is I'll um, we've got I might make this as a download well, so you can have a fence around and play around, and you can maybe make modifications that I certainly couldn't think of. This is the business quarter, and that's one of my first skyscrapers that I built. And I'm back to where we were. Right, guys, I think that is it for today. If you've liked this uh, tour and you want me to do other tours, maybe your world or uh, other worlds, I'll be doing a tour of a world every uh, every Sunday. And uh, well, let's uh, have a get back to each other soon. All right. See you later, guys. Thank you. Bye.